Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode here on Pasties of Skin. It is today, again, another day of Artifacts Mondays. Artifacts Mondays, where we come to play an Artifacts Monday game that actually are hidden objects. The hidden object games, mystery objects, things that you have to find with a wonderful little story wrapped around it. And we've played a number of them over the months in past, and we actually finally did a full playthrough of one of the adventures last week. The guys from Artifacts Monday were pleased uh, to say, they were pleased as punch, they got in touch, they were happy to do so. And they have a new one that's coming out recently on PS4. It, I, I think this is actually Eventide. This game here has actually been out on PC and on mobile for a while. But this is actually one of the most recent releases by them onto the PlayStation 4 and onto the PSN network. This is Eventide 2, The Sorcerer's Mirror. Now, we have we played Eventide 1. What, Eventide 1? Just Eventide. Uh, I think it was Eventide, A Slavic Fable. I think or was or Yeah, I think it was Slavic Fable was actually that one. Um, it was an interesting story. Uh, we were the daughter of... A sorcerer who was um, kidnapped, and we actually had to try to hunt him down and find him again. Uh, we did, that was one of those demo game plays where we got to play through like the first bit of the adventure, and then it was. I don't know if this is going to be a continuation of that girl's story, or if this is a whole separate tale within the Eventide world. But I'm looking forward to seeing it because, in the fact, saying the Sorcerer's Mirror, I think it's going to be a continuation inside the same world where we're probably talking about the same characters left over from the last story, or some unfinished business that was actually happening in it. Uh, but let's check it out. We're going to be playing through the full game today, so be prepared for this. Uh, this is going to be a long haul game. It's going to take a couple of hours to do, but um, I tend to find that these games are not, they're not, they're not madly, maddeningly difficult. And I found every single Artifacts Monday games, whenever they do get difficult, they tend to actually give you an alternate way. There's always an alternate way to make it through. Make sure to get the audio levels right in this. The games do tend to actually have an issue with their audio being a little bit higher and lower, mattering on the, um, <laughs> mattering on the, uh, particular, whoever was doing the audio mixing Soon on that particular day. We will be together, my love. Soon we will be together, my love. Soon. Soon. And you're inside the mirror. So, I'm going to join you inside the mirror. We'll be there forever. Together forever. Like Mirror Master and his wife. Oh, wait, no, I'm pretty sure they got divorced. Okay. Haven't I do Sorcerer's Mirror? Do, 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 do. I've got oh, man. I mean, before we started the stream, I was humming to myself. Hey there. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's with my own message. I was going to like, I was going to look at the message and start reading that out. That's actually me who wrote that. That's my bot. A bot's telling me things. All right. Uh, music volume's okay. Sound volume. We might take them. I take the music volume down. Sound volume up a wee tiny touch. Uh, brightness up a wee bit just for you guys. Um. Just because it tends to be like games. Uh, like I said, the sound volume and the mixture, audio mix levels sometimes are a little bit off, so you can't hear the dialogue over the top of the music. And uh, most of the time, you're going to want to be able to hear me anyway, so we might as well tweak it a little bit. Uh, okay, so obviously, there's reason to go back and play because there's levels. They've, they've developed the game type. It's moving on. Casual or expert? <laughs> An ugly looking expert. Uh, we'll go with casuals as usual. Oh, okay. They've gone the multi-path route now as well. So, are are the Artifacts Monday games going towards a walking, no, not walking dead, a um, Telltale Games path? I'm intrigued by this, I like it. I like this idea. This view is impressive. Is this a girl from the normal world being dragged in accidentally? Ah, that is a noxious looking cloud. Those clouds look weird. Yeah, they should look weird. They're fucking green. Dress up the mountain. What the fuck? Jenny! Okay, fight. Help me. Ugh. Jenny, help me. I can't reach my backpack. I can toss you a pickaxe. Cut the branch. My line won't hold for much longer. Oh shit, we're, we're getting full on. Oh, we're getting full on uh, Tomb Raider on this point. The shit is going horribly right. Yeah, I'm. Uh, let me skip the tutorial. Right, there we go. <laughs> usually, has like one of the things where I'm usually looking at going, like, why am I doing the tutorial? It usually lets me skip this shit. Alright, there we go. Now we jump in here. What is it that we need? We need something to fix. Uh, we need a carboner, I'm sure. Uh, rings. Uh, 
We don't have that much time, guys, so I don't know why we're actually like digging through a bag for things right now. This is probably not the best move. Yeah, uh, oh no, no, no. But we're looking for that, are we? Yes. Um, another one of those? Yes. Uh, we need that? Yes. Uh, that? Yes. What are we down to? We need more caps, is it? Is that it there? Boom. Oh, we <laughs> what? We built a Swiss army knife while hanging from the side of the cliffside. Alright, alright, whatever. Don't ask questions. Jesus! Um, do we cut ourselves down? Do we cut her down? Help! I can't hold on much longer. Alright, do you want me to just use my knife on you? you? You know, I could just use my knife. Don't, don't want to get, get away from the collectibles. Oh, wait, where are we looking? Um, ah! Uh, oh, yeah, um, zoom. Use. Knife. Knifey spoony! You free now? Um. Problem solved! Woo! Damn right I will. What the fuck? Take her away. Hey! I'll get rid of the other one. Fuck you! Son of a bitch! This has gone all Lara Croft in this shit. Ouch. Where am I? Ouch! Lucky to be alive. Who quite a mansion? And I can see a village below. If I can get down there, maybe I can get help. Yeah, might need to do that. Knifey, knifey! Ow! Oh. Alright, well, we actually landed not too badly. Alright. Get that out of the way. Ah! Find someone else to actually use to get in there. Alright, that looks like that was useful. I use a twig. Alright, ah oh, no. Use a twig on that. Aha! Alright, so you use a clever girl. You have that, we go here, and we use this, and we use that. Grab these motherfuckers out of the way. Come on! Get out of the way! Come on, get out of the way! Come on! Come on, you wee viney bastards! Right! Problem solved. Okay, the rest is goes away because we pulled the right through. The size and the behavior of the thorns are unnatural. And this man up there using strange energy. Is it magic? I've dealt with magic before. Have you? Oh wait, is this the same investigator girl? Is it is that the story is that is this story the one with the actual investigator? I'm trying to remember the thing is I'm trying to remember which Artifacts money game I buy because I played so many of these damn things in the last three months or so. I want to make sure I'm actually remembering the right story. I thought Flavia was the the period drama kind of one. Ye arsehole! Jenny! Son of a bitch! You're a bad guy. I know you got an elect uh, you got electric bad guy, but I'm gonna need to use this. Up, hey, up, uh, up, uh. There we go. Bag, grab, all. Ooh, bought this monthly. Fantastic. That's very nice. Mmm. Very interesting. Get the rest of the stuff. Uh, like obviously bandages. They kidnapped my niece. Who is it? My niece. Okay, so it's family. So we're gonna be doing another hunt for a family member that's gone missing. The first is a powerful mage, and the other is my son. Fuck him then. I'm truly concerned about him. You should be. Ragnar, the local herbalist. My leg, oh, it hurts so much. Can you help me? Yes, yes, I, I can. Some medicine. This may help you to prepare it. Oh, okay. Um, I'm assuming that's Yucca. We take the yucca and we're gonna make something. We can put a few things together. Yeah, yeah. So, water and then those three things. Okay. Um, yeah, water and those three things. Did, did we already pick up a pot? No. 
We didn't. Where is the pot? Where's your Oh wait, hang on. Ooh, there it is over there. There we go. Hey birdie boy. Oh come on, get out of the way. Quack! <laughs> Hit the bird, knock it out of the way. Uh, bribe the bird. What am I gonna bribe the bird with? Um, hmm. What else do we have to take? Yeah, yeah, let's see the pot. Cut it off. That'll be the problem solved. Cut it all off. What can I use on this bloody thing? Ah, oh, berries. Ah, uh, we gotcha. Come here, you prick. Eat your fucking berries and get the fuck out of here. Good boy. Excellent. Ah! What? Oh, shit. Alright, uh, this is making herbs. We got another six to get. Yeah, that's one. Oh, there's another one. Um, I'm running out of places to hit here, actually. Where am I looking at? Yeah, uh, one of those. <coughs> I'm either looking for purple. Oh, there's a white flower. Uh, purple, white, or green gathering. Oh, my God. There's a no, purple one. Um, oh, Leaf annoys me. I think it should be someone underneath it. Hmm. Oh, for fuck's sake. Gonna find the last one. Everything here now? Right. So we use that first. What? What? Pour water on the wound. Fix your herbs. Yeah. That's the recipe right there. So what is this? I need. Oh shit! Oh. This a recipe. Looks like a child just took this notebook and drew on it. Very this sweet. This isn't a recipe. Looks like a child just took this notebook and drew on it. Well, very sweet, but I need the recipe. Okay. Deep part. No. Hey, there we go. It doesn't make herbs. Mortar pistol. And the bandage. Yeah. I can treat. Whoa. Huh. That's actually quite useful. Um. Yeah. Full of water. Pistol. And some making herbs. And a bandage. Yep. Yeah. Boom! Happy days! Uh, no, we use Thank that. you. The bridge is damaged, but I can show you another way to the village. We'll find out what happened to your niece. I hope we can save her. I need your help to stop Fardovsky. Right, bring it on. He does. They are truly wicked. Will you help me? Damn right. Right, at least we made it to the village. What the fuck is this? Sucking souls out of men? I've got a present for you. I promise. I find a way to deliver it to you. What the fuck? The mage. I'll hide behind the crowd. He won't see me there. Mary! I thought something bad happened to you. I'm so happy to see you. Please help me. Of course I am. Huh? This in the carriage. I don't know who it is, but she looks just like me. Not good. Enough for today. I have what I need. Please, I need to talk to my husband. 
Have mercy, my lord. No. Take the mirror to my residence. So we been using it to speak to the dead, essentially? Alright. What the fuck? Do you summon a devil dog just to block people from being able to follow him? The guy's an asshole! Shop that's closed, All right? Sadness and depression all around. People aren't burying their dead. I need a drink. That's kind of sucky. When it, like you think about the one thing that's actually guaranteed in life is that the the death and taxes thing generally ends up being the case. You seen but not. Frolic? Does he look well? I'm worried he's not taking his medicine. But you have your worries too. We have to help your niece. Useful, please do. Tarkovsky summon his wolf. It means the ritual is about to start. I can put the wolf to sleep, but I'll need ingredients. Okay. Bring me a few leaves of wormwood. You have to figure out how to get to the cemetery. Maybe the grave digger will help you. Here's the recipe you need. All right. Give the grave digger a beer. Welcome to Luna Village. Are you new here? Come to contact someone who died. Your husband, perhaps. Remember, Tvardovsky won't let you do it for free. Uh huh. Whatever it is, I'm just going to memorize this map. Mm mm. Very useful. Yep, yeah, great. You miss your wife, I'm sure. People come to my inn to forget their longing. Alright, so that's not gonna help me. Oh. I'm not happy that my son works for Tardovsky, but it's his decision and he's determined. There are circumstances. As in your broke? Of my worries. Have you collected all the ingredients to pacify the wolf? No, I have no idea what I'm meant to be doing. Like on this, it looks like I've only got Right, what do I need to grab? Sleeping, sleeping. No, where was, where was the sleeping one? Oh, there we go. It's that, that, and that. So red, green, and a brown thing. Right, whatever. I'm going to look for those things. Uh, right, there's literally nothing for me. To, oh, I'm just hidden objects thing. It's like whenever you look around, there's actually all this stuff to click on. Like, ah, what is that? What am I clicking on for? And I was like, no, it's just because it's there. All right, what's this? Get rid of the nail, so I need a hat. Can I use my knife to do that? Let's walk up to this area and see if there's something we can do. The locals left these items for their loved ones. Leave me alone, stranger. Entering the cemetery is forbidden, but I need to talk with my husband. Do not disturb me, please. Dude, get out of the way of the goddamn front of the guard graveyard then if you're not allowed in here anyway. It's Slavic God Wellis. Wells? Wellis? Willis? Ah, what footy! Every is restricted by the order of Master Tarvatsky. He has an extreme emergency only. The key to this gate is kept by the grave digger. Yeah, so the grave digger has this goddamn key. You my darling. Why when you come back? Oh. When you come back? Is that essentially they're implying that people are going to come back from the dead? Hello, newcomer. Maybe you you help me. All right. Give us a drink. Welcome, stranger. Dagna told me that. But do you plan to give it to this lazy scoundrel? Yeah, it's for him. I'm not gonna lie for him. I can who, but you have to do something for me. All right. I lost something precious below the podium in the middle of the village. If you bring it to me, I'll see what I can do for you. Right. Do I need to actually 
I didn't figure out how to get into this bit then. But I don't have the... What am I going to use to do this instead then? Do you got to give me a hammer? Am I going to find a hammer somewhere else? Uh, maybe there. Oh, wait, the butcher! There we go! Hi, oh, yeah. Please do not disturb me. It's hard enough to run this business since my husband has been gone. Well, in that case, give me something I can use. Yeah? No? Please do not disturb me. It's hard enough to run this business. Fine then. Trying to think, where can I go? I can, go back. I can only go to three or four different places, so I need to find a hammer around the here. Local, these items for the loved ones. Hmm. The locals left these items for their loved ones. I know they did. That's the a great thing. Left these items for their loved ones. I know it's delightful, isn't it, that they did? Hey, bitch dog. Ugh. Yeah, I figured that would be this. Right. Okay. I got a screw. I don't see how the screw is going to help. Um. Right. Right. What well, what I was interacting with previously is no longer interactable. They're all talk 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 talk. No. Um. Anything else to interact with in his space at all? No. 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 Interact. No. It's actually zooming back into him. Right. So, so we've got somewhere to go. What's this? Hmm? Ah, okay. Hang on. There we go, that's that repaired. And then we're gonna use these to pull out these. There we go, I was wondering what, we, wondering what I needed the screw for, it was just literally to re repair the thing. There we go, problem solved, easy got. Get back to it, but whatever I need to give him, I'm assuming it is the brooch. Yeah, this brooch you found, I bought it for my wife, but we're not allowed to go to the cemetery. Before the quarantine, I prepared a place for it there. Can you take it there and give it to her? Tell her it's a gift from me. And can you bring back something from her? Maybe a bow she used to wear in her hair. I miss her so much. Much. Okay. Here's the drink. You're welcome. Yeah, thanks. Okay. Bring me the bow my wife used to wear in her hair. I'll do that. Until they get this guy drunk. Oh, a drink. It's a horrible time to be a grave digger. When people... people stop believing in death. Yep, I got you. All right, moving on. <laughs> <laughs> this is a side story character going like, you don't teach me anything. Can escape death. Yet we all desire our dearest could escape it. Our master, Bardovsky, had known the feeling of loss of the dearest person. He wanted to spare others from it. He promised the villagers he will bring back souls of their beloved. All right. For 
a small price, the villagers can see and talk to their lost ones. Now, they live inside mirrors, but soon the master will bring them back. Mm, I'm not too sure about that. I think he's planning to bring some one of them back. I need to find the way. What's here? Um, can I use a cloth to stop it? No. The woman here looks exactly like Jenny, and the girl from the locket. Strange. Alright, so we need to gather the wormwood, which is the green stuff. Uh, so that kind of wormwood. That's wormwood. That's wormwood. More wormwood. That's more wormwood. Doing the search for wormwood! As the search continues, looking for wormwood. Um. Using this. <laughs> oh, all right, getting the little mice out of the way. How many more of us still got to get? Four more? Good grief. Um, where am I going blind on this? I oh, forgot sick. One more. One more. There we go. I feel like I've actually had passed over like two or three times at this point. Alright, so that's all the wormwood we needed. Um, I think one here, yeah, I can't get this dropped in yet. I need to figure out how to put out this fire. Some pokey. Ah, uh, I recognize what this lock is. It uses the other half of the thing that I find from thing. Aha! Uh, well, we'll go in here, and we'll go in here, and we'll be able to use this to hook it out. No, that's not it. Okay. Never mind. Uh, oh, wait. Hang on, wrong thing. Uh, what can we do? I have no idea what I can use to do this. Um, damn. What else here to grab? I need a rose and incense. I'm gonna find all that. I'm gonna find a rose is a better question actually. Is there a rose here? I need to find some way to stop that wax. I think it's in here. I don't know how to actually undo that. Ay, ay, ay. On here. What? Oh, 
Oh wait, hang on. That? That was nowhere near that long whenever it was given to me. So what am I going to do with a doll? We need a doll to pull out? Oh, I get ya. Alright, now is that going to be using this? Use that to get that. Hey! Skeleton key got. Alright. Identical symbols with the uninterrupted line. Oh, I don't like that. I don't know if I like these ones. So... Okay, I got it. Problem solved. Balls. <laughs> right. Ah, uh, shit. Okay. So we'll go with. With that, 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 that. It means that has to go. Da, 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 da. Okay, so. Ba, 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 ba. Ba, 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 Something has to go awkwardly. Someone has to go the awkward way. Because this has to go that way. Right, let's play that out. Okay, k k k k k. What allows me to get that silver to go around? Because I can't go... I, that silver has to either go down... Where? Is there a point for it to go through? Because... It can't go down... Let's go right, down either here... I can't get through there... The only route is through here. Oh, okay, gotcha. There we go. I was, like, I was overcomplicating that for no apparent reason. Girl, is it Jenny's look-alike? Whoa! I was happy once, but then he kidnapped me. The wizard the fucker. was mad after his wife's death, so he used me in his awful experiment. But I could not forget about my love and resisted. I was weak, but you can defeat him. Damn! Oh. Take this. It can help you. I will. But... Don't take this locket from me. Having it will free my soul. No. Keep the locket, girl. I want you to be free. You should not have suffered this in the first place. Thank you. 
Take this. May it bring you luck in your endeavor. Thanks, no worries. You will be free, girl. You will be free. Should not have been in here in the first place. Motherfucker. I really don't like this Tartovsky guy. We we need to fuck him up. Alright, uh okay, we need to looking for it. In the green. Right there in front of me. Ah. Frustrated if I can't find it. Oh, come on. Is this looking for anything with the right color, even? Oh, for fucks. Right, whatever. Eh, uh, candle dicer. Eh, uh, that was actually useful. That is something we do need. the nail. Pull that shit out. We give to our dead what they loved when they lived. Oh. Okay. Huh? Oh yeah. Now let's put one to this and I can write in incense. Oh wait. Rose. And incense. We have all the things. And go back here. Be a good guy. That. Not the wax, so because it's going to continue on all in there. But uh, put the fruit. Yeah, there we go. Scrape that out of the way. Boom. Did everything we can for the guy. Um, this, however, I figure. Yeah, we'll have to come back to that. Here you go, man. Thank you. That's your bow. So good to see it again. Good man. I need red meat from the butcher. Maybe you can bring her something from the cemetery too. Help yourself to my merchandise. Maybe something here will help you. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. Thank you for your help. I hope you will succeed. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. Why you? Please do not disturb me. It's hard enough to run this business since my husband has been gone. I need this. So. Go on. Please do not disturb me. It's hard enough to. I thought it was going to be something that's like, like knock her out. <laughs> just like go and take what we needed. But no, it wasn't that. Fine then. Um. Yeah. I also need to speak to you, but. It's a horrible time to be a uh, grave sure. digger. Hey. Bring me all the ingredients and help me prepare the sleeping powder. Now help me and put the rest of the ingredients in the cauldron. Ready? Bring me a bunch of lavender to give it a nice smell. Lavender, lavender, lavender. Uh, bushel of purple? Where's bushel of purple? Oh, wait. No, I was looking for it. Still looking for it! What the hell? 
I literally find one of them right here. Oh, there it is. Add rowan berries to color it brightly. Here are those. And some chamomile for a calming effect. Chamomile. Chamomile. Uh, chamomile. Chamomile. Chamomile, 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 chamomile. Where the fuck's the chamomile? Am I blind? Where the fuck is it? Mother! Smash the poppy seed nicely, and then let it boil. Oh, there's more than one poppy? Alright. There's another poppy. Yes. The seed of the poppy! Where is the seed of the poppy? Oh, there it is. Biden. Toadstools will help to give it the proper blow. Here we go. Add chili peppers to mask the bitterness. Red hot chili peppers. The capskin scale is going up. Three drops of valerian will put the wolf to rest. Boom. Everything is in the cauldron. Literally all that needed was the Valerian. The Valerian's the only active ingredient. Power of sleep. Power of calm. Into the powder. And reverse the charm. Here's the sleeping powder. Add it to the meat and feed it to the wolf. This will put him to sleep. Oh, I thank you. I get the goddamn meat. Oh, wait, I got an idea. Hey, up, uh, hey, up, there we go, there's the rest. Open she goes, open there. It seems to be really just like a, take a choice of like, be a dick or be good. I'm gonna stay with the being good here. Oh, it's him. It's so good to see this picture again. Here you are. You may need some meat, so this is for you. Always need a little bit of extra meat, don't we? Alright, so we end up going in here. Go like that. Grab that. Use this. Go and use that with it. Boom! We're just salting the meat. Hey, fuckhead. Okay, Doing this. Sleepy puppy, nighty night. Oh, look at the pupper. Oh, look at the pupper. <laughs> what the fuck is this? The house looks really damaged. Has Twardovsky done it? It doesn't look like a natural disaster. Whoever's inside it, we can flip it around, but we can't actually do anything with it. It's Jenny's scarf. Mother She fucker. wanted me to follow her this way. Okay, let's go the opposite way completely.
Do I need someone glittery to get them to back off? Hmm. All right. Looks like got something else inside his can. It's got more stuff inside his nest that are glittery, so we're going to take a wee walk over to it. Let's get over there. Find them. Use the planks. Oh. Yeah, I'll find them. Be off the... Yeah. There, I can actually hook the width. This house looks really damaged. Has Twardovsky done it? It doesn't look like a natural disaster. Aha! Uh -huh. There we go. So you use that to pop the door off. I thought that was actually going to be used to climb up, but no, not at all. Somehow, so right. So try and find. Oh, there we go. Maybe that'll do into that. That'll allow me to open that, and that'll open up that. I feel weaker and weaker. I know the sickness will take me soon, but I don't want to be like the other people from the village, locked in murder, not living nor dead. Either it's wrong, just wrong. So lucky to have. I'm so lucky to have Robert by my side. He will never let this happen to me. He has enough courage to say no to the master. Well, this is the fact that I was doing it as the husband's wife, and then it was actually his wife's. Either way, it was all good. Some glue to patch that up with. Boom! Way to patch go on it. Um, I need another piece of material. Material. They don't even give a shit, do they? Happy days! Alright, we'll go back now and throw that patch this before the glue, glue dries. Ah, <laughs> uh, what is this? Neat. Alright, that's what we need. We need a patch. There we go. Fire going. That was damn fast. Boy, oh, it's a good jug. Wonder what that meant. Yep.
All right. Button there. There we go. <coughs> Build down. There we go. Got ourselves a hook. Wait. And now we use that with this. Boom! Oh, the whole thing's coming together, I'm telling you, lads. It's coming together! So many shiny things! Don't know which shiny things to take! Yes, yes. So many things that catch my attention with the shininess. Why don't you just take all of it? Just destroy the nest, really, at this point. Um. And this bit, this bit, and this bit. Well, that was one hiding up there in the corner. There's two. Where are these two looking, bally looking pits? Looking baller. Oh, wait, there they are, right there. Nice, there's a nice shiny jewel. I'm going to strike them with it now. Oh, wrong way. Nope, wrong way. Look at the shiny, boys. Look at the shiny. Good man. When Twardowski met his beloved, she, because of her unexpected illness, brought fear to his heart. Oh no! Doctors couldn't help her. Twardowski wanted to find the cure with magic. Not knowing that time was short. There. He could be swore he would bring her back, no matter the cost. Really? She's an asshole. Should have been doing that. Really shouldn't be doing that. You don't understand the love lore and forlornness, but no. Don't fuck with other people's lives to bring back your happiness. Shit. Already gone. An intruder is really teach you not to sneak around. Your mother would be disappointed in you! Ah, I took my knife. Bastard. Well, let's see if we can find ourselves some kind of implement of cutting. Huh? Uh... Sure. Basket letter four. Little lab, right? Use the letter on. Huh. Envelope, of course. Um, pork pitcher basket. Basket. Or. It was a drawing on the horse. Are you kidding me? Uh, I'm sure. I'm gonna look for a fork. There we go. And we find a broken jar. Use that to cut the no. It's not gonna work. Find them.
See you in my life, girl. See you in my life, Jenny. At least that's my self freed. Good days. Okay, now I can move around. Hey, mouse. How about you get the fuck out of here? I got none to feed you, man. Find someone, I'll give it to you. Well, at least we can feed the dude. There you go, buddy. Go. Oh. Sick. <clears throat> oh, I'm not feeling bad for you, you motherfucker. Was he just too sick to deal with me, so he just decided to walk out and lock the room? Fuck you, man. Follow him. Ah, find the second one. Was it? There we go. Alright. Try this. Holy shit, we picked a lock? Fair play, dude. She's actually got a bit of skill there. Yanosik has a child. They seem happy. Not forever. Obviously not forever. Okay, we got a new puzzle. Yanosik was once a peaceful shepherd and a loving son. He worked hard and helped his mother whenever he could. That's getting easy. His wife died when his daughter was born, so he poured all his love into raising the little girl. He promised to protect her from harm. They led a happy and joyful life. He invented new games for her. Games of secrets, hiding places, and adventures. Thus explain all these puzzles. Aww. Aww. Is that, that broken horse in the back room of us is actually the daughter's toy? That's sad. That actually is properly sad. Sorry guys, I'm shifting my feet around here because I've got an itch in my foot. <laughs> Get out! Boom! Problem solved. Oh. It's a sculpture? Don't know what that's going to be used for. But we'll find out soon enough. Maybe it was this one right here. Haha! <laughs> we got one piece of sculpture, four pieces of sculpture?
Another drawing last time, but will it help me find my way through the maze? No. Don't know what the goddamn maze is, but um Butterfly is the last sign, so it's the last thing. Did we not tell you that the last thing that you'll see is the butterfly? There we go. You know, it's a matter of lining up the end of each cylinder. So it is horse, sun, butterfly. Horse, sun, butterfly. Hey! Horse, sun, butterfly. So, horse. Horse. Um, sun, and butterfly. I know you helped to defeat my wolf. Stay out of my affairs, woman. I will not. Fuck you, guy. I'm not afraid of Give me back my goddamn niece. You should be. You should learn not to interfere with a master's affairs. You Dude, shut the I fuck up. You up. You're a nuisance. Don't you fucking swing at me, motherfucker. Oh no. Another attack of his sickness. Please help us. No! Fuck you, guy! Deep down, he is a good man. He has just been tricked by Twardovsky. Then fucking keep hurting! Elixir for him, please. You uh, will find all you need in my notes inside the hut. Please, hurry. Fine. If I change the amount of ingredients, this elixir can cause paralysis for a few hours. Janosik wouldn't interfere then. Hmm. If I change the amount of ingredients, this elixir can cause paralysis for a few hours. Janosik wouldn't interfere then. So, hmm. Maybe you're actually like doing the random click around and you actually find a bunch of objects and then you actually go like, right, I'm going to look at the actual list of things I need to find. Ugh. Now, I have one thing I'm actually being a little bit disappointed in since, um. Maybe, I think it was, uh, Cur the Cursed Heart or whatever it was, the, uh, Terrors from the Deep or Nightmares from the Deep. I haven't been able to, they haven't done the whole secondary game thing anymore where you actually do something else instead of the hidden object. Like a, a set of uh, match two or domino or that kind of thing. Which I thought was actually a good choice. It was a good way to kind of like break up the gameplay if you got sick of playing the one game type. Or you did what I do and actually like scan the entire rooms tapping on absolutely goddamn anything because your eyes are not focusing on an object that you need to find. Oh dear god. Oh, the music's damn cool, though. Where am I? This is gonna happen fast already? I'm looking for that, that cone top and the wee peg and turn. Motherfuck. 
Fucker. I think the other one's being used as a lid somewhere, but I'm trying to figure out where. Oh no, that's oh, that's what I need to find. I need the peggy bit. I thought, I thought that's what I found there. Hmm. Where are you? Wait, boop. There it is. Found it. Jeez, Cradle looks like a Fabergé egg. Really not liking that, that's not cool. so I need to find something else. You will find all you need in my notes inside the hut. Please, hurry. Yeah, I'll find all I need in the notes, but I'm trying to find the actual objects and I to bloody put into them. And it's hook, that's what it is. Plugged into the gut. Brass, brass, and we were breaking that. Mission for a rope.
Let me know how to dig, but I don't have anything to dig with. The door is ajar. You like bells? Chipmunk! Wherever the hell you are. Got some sap, got some resin. Big days. set on fire, but maybe that's not the right thing to do. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh wait, now I know what I need to do. I need to go back in here. I need to go up to this thing. This in here. Click, click. All done, dusted. And find the things that are in here. Well, lantern gotten. Happy days. I'll hide the new ladder in our secret place. Toys will be the key. She will love it. Okay. Happy days. Everything's right here in front of me. Why can't I pick any of it up? Oh, I need to bite his head first. Okay, I got gotcha. you. That's probably what's in the wee tiny bit of the hill here. So we use that. That lights it up. We can still see what we're looking for. We got the head and we got the stick that we needed. Good, good, good. first and then we can pick up the rest. Yep. Oh, 
am I forgetting? Somewhere like it. There we go. You know, something wrong with the tail didn't look right. Oh, and another adventure happens. One day, Janosik's daughter was playing by the river. She went on a boat to catch some fish. But then the weather turned bad. Went on the boat to catch some fish. Then the weather went awful and the world fell apart. Yannick as Yannick, right. by this part of his heart, taken it from him. Too late. He blamed himself for letting it happen. In his grief, he was watched over by the master of this land and his servants. Whose green clouds were behind us? Cheeky bastard! He would revive the girl. He had the power to do so through magic. Janosik agreed to serve the sorcerer. He believed his daughter would be brought to life again. Frustrating whenever I'm actually looking at it, going like, I can't see anything else of that color. Really? Mm. I'm keeping my eyes peeled, but I'm just looking here and I can't spot. Another one of the right color. I want to be able to like peel down a couple of these things because it seems like there's a lot of objects still sitting in the way of other stuff. What? No! What? No! I already clicked that so many times. So he wasn't always Twardovsky's servant. Maybe there is still hope for him. So he wasn't always Twardovsky's servant. Maybe there is still hope for him. What's this one? Rotate the circles in such a way that each of them will only connect. Oh no! Oh god, no.
Oh, I hate this. Let's try and actually get them to maneuver without losing. This is going to be frustrating as fuck. Right. Frustrate me because it is actually a, such a simple puzzle in its own way, but it's just about getting the rotations right. If I if you lose track of them incorrectly.
is drive me around the band, drive me around the band, drive me around the band. You can completely understand what I'm trying to do with this mini game, but it's driving around the band. Well, that's going. This is the first time I'm going to be using the skip mini game in this at all. Oh, God almighty, that drove me around the band. Oh, because it's actually, once you get them too close together, you have to actually find a way to space them back out again so they rotate in the right way, and I made a mess up when I was doing that. Oh, that, otherwise I was going to just drive me around the... That, that, I was... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, I'm going to lose my shit if I had to keep doing it. Yay, now we can wind her up. Hey, and we'll put that in there. Hey, me a chestnut figure for you. Play with it happily, Daddy. Play with it happily, Dad. Made the figure for you. Okay. So, uh, we got a chestnut. Right? So what are we what are we still missing from our ingredients list? That's the question I'm actually wondering about now. Do we have uh, we still need the roots? So we need to go back and get the roots. Oh yes, uh, broken shovel needs to have its handle put onto it, so boom. And now we can use that. Yep. Back to the river, crossing the river, into the spot, dig that bitch up. What? Yes. Ah, oh, let's see. Yeah? Then can we use it? Boom. Problem solved. <laughs> the root on that actually kind of reminds me of the, um, what was it? Um, Mandragora? Is it Mandragora? The one that you pulled out, it's like, <laughs> And if you hear it, you actually go deaf. Right, problem solved. Now we have to go and mix all this shit together. Sure, he's probably died of a heart attack in this entire time it's took me to do this crap. So, resin, heat, mushrooms. Alright, cool, I got it. Oh, pff, let's see. Of course I'm going to stab. I've already gone this far in the story. I'm going to stay with this actual... Like, we've got another one point after this that's going to actually decide the path of the story. I'm pretty sure I'm, I have no problems with doing that. So, uh, no, I need to... Do I need to light the stove? What do you want me to use to light the stove? Matches, there we go. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Somebody that needed to light the stove, I'm going like, no, I need to put the resin first. I'm going to take the knife. The mushrooms. Boom. Then go in. Next, uh, what was after that? Mushrooms? Uh, oh, we have to shave the root. Shave the root. It goes in. And then it's all of that. Well, this and that go in there. Mash it up. And what was it? Yeah, mash it up. Put that into there. And we stir this. Pour that into that. Make this into plastic. There we go. Boom. Done and dusted. The Alexa, an extremely expensive looking bottle that looks like nothing quickly. that she would use otherwise. Give him the elixir quickly. No. You're gonna promise not to be a dickhole? You promise not being a dickhole? I will give you the elixir. That's the way we play this game. Thank you. It's better now. Why did you help me? Because I don't like looking at an idiot Your fucking suffer. An evil man, and he has done terrible things. What do you know about it? Do you have any proof? No. I found it on the dead body of a girl he killed. Master told me that he let her go. He lied to me. There you go. And he promised me something. That's why I serve him. Bring back your daughter, I imagine. I promise to bring back my daughter. I will listen to you if you prove to me that his promise is fake. 
I already did. Lead the way to Master's house. Come with me. I'll give you the directions on the way. All right, let's rock and roll. That's two. One, two, three, four. Two, three, four, five. Two, three. Two, three, four. One, two, three. Two, three, four. No! Destination found. Destination well, unlocked. You, human, you won't fool us so easily this time. I'm going to fool you twice as easily this time. You know that, right? Snippity snip nip. Pop the lock. <coughs> there we go, that needs a handle. I've got boots. Load your boots in your motorcycle. Spurs. Horse spur feather whip rig. Ah, there we go. Rick. Feather, 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 feather. Feather? Yes, they're feathers. Oh, they're. It's also the fact that we put an object right next on this, someone that actually looks like a different color. Motherfuckers. Alright, so this is all set up now. Actually, trap these fuckers. Um, we just sit down here. And put that shit on that. Ah, oh, there we go. Go. Whoopsie daisy. What's this? Who is it? Who's shooting? Shooting? All right. <laughs> you guys are dumb as a bag of hammers. You know that, right? I wanted it ready yesterday. I need this necklace now. Ah, okay. Yes, master, I I will bring it soon. I'll bring it soon. I need it now. Ugly sluggard. Fuck you, guy. Do not fuck with Dobby. You'll be sorry. Poor imp. How can he treat him like this? You treat him as like fucking help. Like he's an asshole. He's an asshole in all methods and forms. Just what? Okay. Oh my god, there's so many things to find here. Alright, so many things here that I need to actually unlock. I just need to go to the student, wake him up. 
There you go, little guy. Who are you? How did you get here? Thank you. He is angry because I broke the magical necklace. The fireflies escaped, and I lost all the crystals. Can you help me repair it? Mm. There's a storage room inside the house where you'll find the instructions. I put the necklace in the kitchen cubby and hid the key to it. You'll find the first part of the key near the stove. Here's the second part. Why well, have a feeling this is not gonna be the thing I need? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that was gonna be the thing I need. What, are you? No, oh, God. the necklace no I have not prepared the necklace fuck cheap bastard in a bastard for help like that okay I've got all this other stuff that I need to be doing but you want me to be opening the thing with fine I forgot what I meant to use this key on nothing else here I was sitting there the entire time and didn't even notice it. Son of a bitch. Catching the firefly. Catching all the fireflies to light my way. Oh Jesus. Um Right. So T Butter. That's the bread. Pincers and spoons. Pincers and spoons. There's a spoon. Pincers. I am pinching your face. I am crushing your head. I am crushing your head. I am pinching your face.
Oh, there it was. Oh, dear God. Hey! Hey! Alright, we've got a sun and a moon. I'm doing that goes on to the guard of some sort. Nice. So that it suppresses magic energy? I can disturb Tvardovsky's ritual this way. The necklace can be assembled so that it suppresses magic energy? I can disturb Tvardovsky's ritual this way. Uh, sure that'll be helpful, but I don't have anything that I actually made to put that together yet. So we'll come back to you very shortly. Yeah, it's still that same one that I was looking at there. Just all the other things I was looking at. Alright, so that's everything in here that I can actually really do at the moment. Yeah? Alright, so we need to jump back out here and you go to this guy. We need to put in a sun and a moon. Each of his nipples. That was one arm of the clock. Boom. Okay, so one arm of the clock. Resolved. What else do we have? Yes, there's the other diamond in the hallway. That one. Ah, uh, here we go. Necklace crystals. Alright. I think we find all these crystals. Everything that looks crystal like. One, two, three. Um, one up there. Ow. The way I'm leaning this chair, it's making me feel very uncomfortable. I'm doing it because I actually need to get closer to the screen to be able to spot what I'm looking for. One left to get. Oh, it's the last one. Oh, there it was right there. Happy days. I'll need all the rest of the bits as well. Uh, never mind. Um, get that off. This bit on there. Hey! Little bits that I needed. Alright, so they're trying to actually make a pattern all the way around the outside. Okay. So. connect each other too as well, isn't there? That was the easiest one because actually has the loop back around. That's obviously not in the right place. That was. This has to be like that. That possibly needs there. there.
Uh, move the flower cores along the uh, cracked flower. Is okay. Um, all right, so let me get the colors into the right one. Okay. That's better. Pick up the red strings and use them to match pairs of similar symbols. Okay. So wait, what? All right, now I got you. The necklace is a that stopped Vardovsky's ritual. It can save Jenny. Kidoki? So, is that me done with this book? Because I thought there was actually more stuff for me to unlock, but we'll see. feeling that he's going to change it just for the fact that I've got a feeling that I'm actually <sighs> this might not be the right choice to make but I'm going to be honest with everything I don't like the imps I don't like them I'm not going to lie to him then I will drop the necklace stealthily and hide thank you for warning me I can give you a key to the master's office. You need to go there if you want to stop him. There's a secret passage from the office to the dungeons. Useful. Master keeps his machinery there. And prisoners, too. Master is coming. Hide. Quick. All right, fine. The necklace is ready. Good. That's almost everything. Come with me. I need help with the final preparations. Okay. Go to his office now. His office. Oh, I'm, oh, there we go. Boom! Office door opened. When they met, the outside world stopped existing. They could spend long hours together, fascinated by their research on magic. The bond between them was strong. Oh. But soon he became so absorbed in his studies that he forgot about her needs. The darker his magic became, the more lonely and he barely noticed her illness setting in. Only magic mattered to him, until it was too late, when he realized that his wife mattered more. <laughs> Same old story. Same old story. You know, become dark mage. Wife gets sick, then you realize you actually should have been made, taking care of her the entire time instead of taking care of yourself. Typical, typical story. You know, these romantic stories are getting so cliched. <laughs> okay. Oh, got the hiccups now. It's all the excitement. I've got the hiccups from excitement of what we're doing. 
I thought I really need to drink of water to look sight of dehydration. Mmm. That helped. Let's see. Alright, we know what we need to do now. We need to jump back in here. So we've got a couple new things to look at. We've got this. Open in here. That's candelabra. Still curious about this. Ribbon. I don't have anything I can use as a lever. This is what defines on. But if we use this, I'm gonna fix this first. Boom. Oh, there's one more missing, I'm imagining. Isn't there? Yeah, there probably is. Go. Oh, there's an R hand for the clock. I knew that was gonna. No, I knew there was actually parts of this that were actually gonna like take us back to another room, but. Come on. Need to make progress. Boom. A lever? That looks like a lever. Oh, it's a window? No, we have to do the window first. Da, 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 da. Boom, boom, boom. Jimmy had opened with a knife. Oh, right. Pearl earring. Could be used for something else. Another pearl earring, I imagine. Oh, there we go. There's a pair. So, ribbon? Cameo, heart, lily, swan. Oh, God. Swan. Uh, lily, 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 lily. Oh, wait. I thought I might have been looking for a song. drawing a song in the background. Heart and lily. I always got a feeling it's going to be someone that's drawn onto someone else and that's going to annoy the balls of me whenever I can't find it. Yep. Yeah, it was. And a heart. Here's a heart. Someone that's a heart like. What is heart like in all of these things? There we go. Find it. Um, cabinet part designed to go into this, so it goes in here. There it is. What is this? That was easy enough. <laughs> you guys got the worst security method in the entire world. I met with Boruta. He showed me how to harvest vital energy and how to sustain life. I am immortal now. I will live in this village hidden from the world until I find a solution to bring Anna back. And I should create the mirror and summon Anna's soul. If only I had enough energy to bring her back. I have to harvest more energy. And I need a body for her soul to take. I made many mirrors throughout which... Through which to show the souls of the dead to the villagers. It's only a trick. But they believe it is real. They have... This has caused huge amounts of energy. Especially since I closed the cemetery. All my calculations are correct. I can revive my wife and only her. This proves that Yanosik's daughter won't be revived. Poor man. I have to talk to him. Asshole move, man. Asshole move. Did you find something? Yes. These are his notes. It's clear he can revive only one person. And that's what he intends to do! Cheek of him. Oh, you were right. And I did all this for nothing. Yep. Hard condition and all. You save your niece. Go to the dungeon and find her. I will stop him here to give you more time. Okay, but well watch out for the magics. It will help you find a way to defeat him. Then why is it not going to help you? Alright, I got it. I know where this goes. Hey, yeah!
Okay. One. And, uh... Two. Let's move on to the next page. Alright, and that one. The power of the mirror comes from the amulet. It is drawn from the magic symbols engraved in the stone. Activating different symbols can reverse the power of the amulet and the mirror itself. The ritual of the lens can recalibrate the amulet. Take the lens and put it in the magic smoke created from oriental incense and exotic feathers. Draw the current symbols from the amulet in the smoke. A magical lens can be used to find new runes from the amulet switch. The runes and the power of the mirror will be reversed. Okay. Here's a description of the things you need. One, two, three, four, and five. Instructions to prepare the magic lens and change the power <laughs> of the it out in this parchment book. Twardowski's mirror. I'd better keep it. Instructions to prepare the magic lens and change the powers of the amulet and Twardowski's mirror. Hey! Hidden page behind the last page. There was actually a big bulky bit in the book. There you go. That's kind of surprising. Secret entrance way. to put it in there. So, interesting. God damn it. So many things I know I'm going to have to actually search for now. I'm looking at each one and I'm like, oh god, that's another guaranteed period of time. Jenny's in there. I think this window can be opened, but the holder is missing. We'll continue on searching. The master found out that the necklace is not working as he wanted. He will punish me. You have to do something. I know that the power of the mirror can be reversed by means of a lens. You can do it. And when you do, the mirror will draw a master inside it. Well, that way he can still be with his wife forever. Happy days. We all win. Go find it. Put a feather inside a thing so you can find a feather. Six to twelve. God damn it, there's so many more to find. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. Well, woo!
There we go. I wonder why they were actually all sitting to hold the wrong things. We're like, wait, oh, I have to move them now. Okay. Our base. I knew that's what it was going to be, but I don't know why I actually was like looking at it going like, I have no idea what that object is. But I knew it was going to be like a scarab shell or a body of some sort. I don't know where I got the idea from. Chest figure, chest figure, where the f chest figure? Oh, there it was right there in front of me. I'm looking at it the entire time. Obviously, because of imp logic, it is not stored in the same place as the. Uh... Oh wait, hang on. Hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil. It's a clue! And a raging clue. Before they need it. There's no way I'm going to remember that. So red is square with a line through it. So if you give me that and that. Uh, blue is a circle with a half division on it. So we'll do that and that. And green is a zigzaggy line. So one half of it and the other half will be a... Oh, Ooh, I'm soft. The lens of the magic smoke and then use it to find a code to recalibrate the amulet. Jesus Christ! Okay. I tried Fernflower magic, but it didn't work. Lens! Uh oh. Coming to get you. Coming to get you. Omi is here and no healy will wreck you. Don't even question the fact that this door wasn't locked anymore. Really?
Looks like a place for the ritual. This mirror is really intimidating. Yes, it is. Well, that means it's too hot. Who knows? Well, we'll actually be able to turn that off soon enough. Um, the things, searching for all the things, opening the things, press the buttons on the things, getting all the things. Make sure we go and grab all of the things. Jesus Christ, actually, with, my, with like a sweeping glance like that, I actually managed to get Mojo out of them. <laughs> um, let's check for a component. Where be you? Better question. Oh, there we go. Oh, the steampunk Magitech wrench. I want a Magitech wrench in Final Fantasy XIV for the engineer's class. That'd be awesome. Magitech wrench. I want one. I want one so bad. It's like almost as good as a sonic screwdriver. Mm -hmm. Oh, Jesus. Be serious. Hey! That thing we're searching for. Candle. That's all we got. That's all that was worth. Right. So <laughs> I'm out of context now we're going like where the fuck are we using these for? Alright. Boom! Need one of those. Over here. Put you in there. That was. Hey, forget him. And there's something dark that we couldn't see before. Remember? Yeah, it was here. Boom. Pip, pip. Boom! Good old espionage still works even in a magical world. Take the wrench, do it! Take the wrench, do it! Stop off the flu of light! Yes! Hell? All right, there's a key we're meant to be using this the whole time. I wonder where I was holding on to that key for so long. Oh Jesus, no one. I'm doing the the <laughs> the gliding tap and spread. Padlock open, magnifying glass. Come on. Yeah, magnifying glass. Ah, I find it. Yay! Hey! 
I'm so cold! I spoke with the imps. They are miserable. He's treating them awfully. But they like me. Aww. I found this in my pocket. Maybe it'll help you. I can set things on fire. Being able to set things on fire is always a very important skill. Yay! Wait. Mmm, a lovely globule of wax. Get the wax imprint. Pick it up. Pick it up, pack it in, let it begin. The spell casting session is needs to make sin. Yeah. Where did you go to do that? All right, that does table. Mmm, delightful. Motherfucker! This way, my dear. You son of a bitch! Jesus! Boom, got it. You think you are better than me? We both want to achieve our goal no matter the cost. The well, my kiss is just to save my niece, you fuckhead. Think? You are a monster. I can stop you. He gathers magic to attack you. You can avoid the missiles. Hide to the left or right. Good luck. Oh. This really feels like a Telltale Games event. Strange. Okay. So we've got a series of little puzzle events to do here. Take me instead. You can do it. Hmm. We got this shit covered, man. Fuck you and your floaty fireball bullshit. Enough! Leave her! You are an a-hole! What's this? What? 
The hell? Defeated. <laughs> go on, you undead bastard. You. Just go on into the other realm. Be with your wife. Happy days. Nice. So I'm just the happy that this isn't going to harm anybody else. Works. You need to reverse the power of the amulet. Okay. So I need to. Uh, no, not what I'm looking for. Hang on, what do I need? I need to have uh, that. Is that what I need? Is that done? All right, fair enough. Oh, baby girl, we're glad we're okay. Finally, everybody else's spirits can go free now that he's gone. Give freedom to every last one of them. Evil mage defeated. People from the world can now rebuild their lives. It won't be easy to recover, but Yagna and her son seem to have enough strength to start over. And I believe they will find a place for the imps in the village. Ah. Oh. We find the happiest ending. Booyakasha, motherfuckers! <laughs> that is even tied to the Sorcerer's Mirror completed. Uh, production by the House of Fables. Uh, the House of Fables has a lot to answer for, for how very similar that felt in a lot of places to a Telltale Games experience with um, little kind of action oriented events. Uh, obviously, maybe the older hidden object games weren't really. Uh, part of the timeline for the modern Telltale oeuvre. So that might have been the reason why they weren't exactly similar to it in the past. Uh, and the games have developed that kind of similarity over time since. But fair play to all the people that actually worked on that. This is actually, um, I enjoy the hell out of this. Um, uh, yeah, I, I enjoy an Artifacts Monday hidden object game. This one felt a lot more light on the backstory and light on the interest it literally is just an instigate an event and complete event um don't know much about the girl who was actually in this or the niece it feels like um a less narrative event and more of a mechanical event than anything else so i, I can't say i was actually as intrigued i, I still want to go out and play that clockwork uh clockwork tales ones of uh, clockwork and ink that one looked really really fun it looked like it had like uh Zeppelin Nazis and steampunk and a cool interesting like action oriented main character in it but um the Eventide 2 this didn't really feel as intriguing as some of the ones have in the past just a absolute arsehole of a villain that just wanted to take people's souls I just like they kind of threw a lot in there at the very beginning with the actual soul stealing right up front um, maybe they might want to like to bury the lead on that. Maybe he actually just had so he laid his hands and like there was a light, and then that actually like, didn't explain that he was literally just capturing their souls into a bottle. Um, the 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 price was actually his friendship or something like they could have given us. Maybe, maybe there was a a need for a little more subtext rather than overt text in this particular case. But yeah, uh, another fun game from Artifacts Monday. I enjoyed it. Uh, there's obviously a, a long, long tail of many other games to be played here on the channel made by that company because they produce very, very quickly. But uh, yeah, Eventide 2. That was actually kind of fun for Sorcerer's Mirror. Obviously, this doesn't have a secondary story, but it does have replayability for at least a possible second ending, um, mattering on the other choices you make during the gameplay. So... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what else to actually kind of like do with the game. Should we come back and play this again? If you guys want to see me play it again to get the other ending, the other 
decisions ending. Maybe like it, there might be three altogether, considering the fact you might have mixed choices or whatever. But um, yeah, I didn't think I did too badly in that on the collectibles either. 10 out of 14, 12 out of 20. Eh, I missed a couple, but I wasn't really paying attention for those anyway. I was clicking on everything else around it. So yeah, Eventide 2, Sorcerer's Myrrh. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you actually enjoyed this, um, and if you enjoyed another Artifacts Monday, then make sure to actually share around the channel, check out the rest of the playlist, and do all the similar things that people should do that enjoy people's channels, which is like the subscribe, follow, and all those kind of things too. And if you don't want to do that thing, you don't want to hit the subscribe button or the follow button or the bell or whatever that kind of crack is, then just ask me, I just ask you to do one thing. Memorize the name. Pastiche of skin. Pastiche. The pistachio. Not pastiche. Not pastichu. Pastiche of skin. That's the name. It's written down there. It's easy to find. I hope you can find me because I'm not trying to hide. And um, if you happen to be watching this on YouTube, there'll be a button up there I would really like you to hit. And over here will be the most, uh, well, playlist. There'll be the um, Artifacts Monday playlist. But the far side will be the most recent episode on the channel. Over here will be a video just for you based on the user analytics and all the things they do on YouTube that choose out the stuff. It'll be a video that you'll enjoy. So I highly recommend you watch that one first because you'll probably have a great time. And I think it's actually a good piece of art right there on its own. You should check that out. Yeah, you really should. So, um, yeah, thank you very much for watching, and I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye.